now we are going to see how to identify an IC by seeing the numbers written on it so in digital electronics we will usually find two series of ICs which are very commonly used first is 74 series and the other is 4000 series or here in this uh, image that you can see here we have taken 74 series of ICs 74 series of ICs so in 74 series of ICs first two or first few characters that are written over here indicates the manufacturers or gives the information about the manufacturer for example SN here indicates that this IC has been manufactured by Texas Instruments Texas Instruments right now the other few combination of letters and alphabets will indicate the logic series logic series logic series where this 74 74 here also indicates the temperature range for this particular IC suppose if 74 is written then it can withstand a temperature ranging from 0 to 0 to 70 degree centigrade similarly if 54 is mentioned over here then it can withstand a temperature starting from minus 555 degree to 125 degree centigrade now the other uh, now this this combination will give you the information 74hc for example here this will give you the information about the logic series logic series that means what are the uh, what are the specifications uh, some basic ones like uh, uh, like uh, whether it is uh, VC, uh, how much uh, is the VCC required for this IC what is the speed and so on so suppose if if uh, it is mentioned 7 4 simply and there is no combination of alphabets then it will simply indicate indicate that it is a TTL is it, it is a standard TTL logic TTL standard take a TTL standard TTL standard 74 suppose uh, here you find 74 LS 74 LS it will indicate low power Scott key low power Scott key similarly 74 H H C it is high Scott key 74 S Scott key simply Scott key 74 V H C that uh, that will be very high speed uh, very high speed now uh, now you will find uh, after this logic series after this logic series you will have combination of letters and that will indicate the function of this device that will indicate the function of this device suppose here in this case we have 04 which is for logic logic not gate logic not gate suppose here you will have 00 this is for NAND gate NAND 2 input NAND gate similarly suppose here you have uh, 0 2 it is 2 input NOR gate NOR gate 0 uh, say 0 8 it is AND gate 32 it is OR gate and so on so this uh, two or three combination of two or three letters it will indicate what is the function of this device and finally it will be followed by a letter letter which will uh, which will indicate the package so here while uh, using an ic in this especially in this digital electronics lab you 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 just have to worry about or you just have to find the number 74 suppose in 74 series 74 followed by the combination of numbers with, uh, which will indicate which indicates the function that is for for uh, example in this case it is 7404 the number of the IC here here we have 7404 so 7404 what it will indicate is a hex inverter hex inverter that means it is having six number of not gates so inverting gates that is hex inverter
similarly for 4000 series ic also we will have uh, the numbering almost similar this uh, this three or the first combination of first few letters this will give the manufacturer's information manufacturer's information this two this two will give the logic series series followed by the device type device device type type uh, which type of gate for example for example which gate which gate uh, is present the present uh, this is manufacturer manufacturer this one is the series 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 and followed by buffered output it indicates b here indicates buffered okay, buffered output so basically what you have to find is 4002 this will be the ic number that you are looking for in uh, 4000 series ic for example first uh, here we have we simply have to ignore the manufacturer's information uh, we just have 7400 this ic is 7400 this ic see uh, sn ignore it 74 just hc you have to ignore it 7400 7400 this one here also 74 ls just leave ls out of here 7400 here we have 7432 7432 here we have 747432 7, 7, see here we have 7 74 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7, 7474151 so this is how we are going to see the uh, uh, by seeing the ic we are going to find its uh, identify its number 7408 here see this is a uh, 4000 series ic manufacturer information just leave it 4001 ic number here also we have uh, this uh, 4 4000 series ic 4002 here 74 7404 7404 this one is 4000 series ic 4002 4002 so we have seen here how to identify the ic number from uh, from the things that are written on the IC mm, written above the IC we have to identify the number now for each IC say 7408 there is a specification sheet mentioning its pin diagram uh, uh, along with the other things pin diagram how the gates that are present logic gates that are present inside this is connected so uh, for each and every IC, we will have a specification uh, sheet uh, which will give the details uh, along with the pin diagram. Along with the pin diagram, that is, what are the contents of this uh, particular IC and how uh, those contents are arranged inside it. And the uh, pin diagram will indicate you how to connect uh, those devices or those uh, uh, circuit elements that are present inside this uh, uh, to the circuit outside uh, this IC how to connect this and how to make connection to different pins so we will seeing that in the next class